next up, Fred for Ed. And more on today's news. Please stand. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Good morning, everybody. I've returned. I'm Lathan. And I'm Abby. Today, Mr. Potts' classes should report to room 149 with their laptops and study materials. This is for all class periods. For lunch today on lines one and two, chicken bowl, line three, soup and salad bar with broccoli soup, line four, a mini corn dogs or assorted four by six pizza, and line five is closed. A happy birthday today goes out to Renee Alanis, Odessa Hibbard, Lizbeth Ramirez, and Jenny Venegas. A special happy birthday goes out to Mrs. Hartman and Mrs. Schaefer. Now to sports and weather. Thanks, Abby. The snow is slowly disappearing. We will be receiving some better weather for this weekend, with a high of 20, 38 today and a low of 23 tonight. And if you were late to school because of the train this morning, don't worry, you're not alone. Now to Bain with sports. Thanks, Yulia. There is a girls basketball game tonight at home against, J against Western. JV starts at 6 and varsity starts at 7.30. Make sure to support your lady hot dogs. Last night, the Steelers and Browns played, and since the Browns had a great offensive line and the defense only let them score seven points, the Browns had it in them to come away with the win. That's all for sports. Now back to your host. Next week is Ice Up. So every day, we will run on a two-hour delay schedule, unless you have to take the test. Buses will still be running at regular time, though, so if you don't have another way to school, you'll have to camp out in your community. If you think it's not fair that you have to take the test and everyone else gets to sleep in, well, we've done hard time. So pass the test and you'll be able to take advantage of that as well. Also, school will not be in session on Tuesday, so don't worry about showing up unless you're really dedicated. It's cool that school is canceled next Tuesday, but do you know why? More than 100 school districts have canceled class next Tuesday to allow teachers to attend the Red for Ed Action Day at the State House. More than half a million kids will be out of school representing around 45% of the state's public school students. Teachers will not only be fighting for their rights, but for students as well. That's it for the announcements today. We left it all out there for you. Come back again on Monday and we'll have more for you. Have a great weekend, hot dogs. <laughs>